swooped over and and not the uh, right size container for them. It's just overly populated with roots. But these guys are doing real well. My cucumbers and my okras. And I need more room. I'm going to make another one of these totes um, so that you guys can... Uh, can see how it's made. I don't drill anything. No holes, no nothing. I actually reuse the cap and I, uh, I put my own two inch plug and my bell siphon right into the middle of it. The cap is a watertight cap. These are water or liquid tight containers. So um, cycling beautifully. It's doing what it's supposed to. And my, my monsters are doing very well. There are my, my totes. I'm uh, going to be turning these. I'm going to make one of them a, uh, a single unit, uh, the ones you see on the internet. Basically, uh, cut the top off, flip the top over. Bottom's going to be my fish tank, top's going to be the grow bed. So I'm going to make one of those just so uh, so people can see they can have this at home They're on their own uh, on their own property. If they, even if they don't have a yard, uh, they can have it uh, in a small a uh, small backyard or a small little patio area and they can grow their own healthy vegetables with my grapes so that's it oh let me show you guys my uh, this, these guys are still doing okay too I was thinking of transferring these guys into the uh, the new one but I have watermelons and they are growing Here's my money tree, and it's also giving me a bunch of new new growth. But I don't know if you see that there. There's another watermelon. There's another watermelon. There's another watermelon, and that's a sweet pea, which tends to do much better in the soil than it is in my aquaponics. So I'm probably just going to transfer this one into into a bucket like this by itself and see how well that does. And my money tree is hopefully going to bring me some money. Well, it has been, actually. Um, it's got new growth, which is also a good sign. Look at those guys. They're all new. And I've been giving it my pond water, so that's going to finally get used to I might transfer this into one of the tiers in my waterfall. So I'll put it in there, and it'll get constant, uh, constant water from the pond. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to end with this note that your drainage is extremely important. And I suggest you set it up. I still have yet to hook up my little nursery right here. I should do that. I have plenty of hydrogen. And, of course, the bees, they love to come and drink. All right. Well, thank you for watching.